Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. Today we're going to be talking about what happened to Death Stalker. Like, we obviously know he came last year, but like, everybody wanted him to come out in the 2023 ISC. But due to the halfway to Halloween uh, teaser, um, there it's supposed to be like a carnival display, but yet, like, uh, he doesn't belong in a carnival. But like, honestly, I really want him, I, I don't know if he is, these manuals, right, uh, these screenshots don't seem real to me but like he says believe it or whatnot but i don't know i'm gonna hold off for him for now because i just want to figure out is he coming back that's probably what the most um people want is for him to come back i mean he's a reskin of krampus don't get me wrong but he is so cool to like um he's just like an amazing prop i uh, I really liked him. I didn't pick him up this year because I was on a low budget when it came down to the last prop. And I just pretty much forgot all about him. And I wasn't able to get him. But I hope he's still in stock so we could purchase him Yippee! this year. Okay, well, like, honestly, we really need... I mean, I'm not so sure, like... If he's coming back, he they do say online only, but, like, I didn't really check if the in stock... Because I'm just dying for him to be in store. Like, we could just see him at Flagship. Um, not that I want to see him in the con or everything. Hell no. We... <laughs> I, I bet you it's just going to be, like, a whole bunch of clowns mixed with, like, zombies. Pretty much anything you'd think of from Spirit. But, like, we really need Deathstalker back. Like, honestly, this will not... Uh, he he's an obviously an amazing like animatronic he didn't really show up in that many haunts though to be honest like he showed up at this haunt and he did show up at um what he i think he showed up at brick thunder yeah he showed up at brick thunder's house uh he showed up in um a few others i don't think i've ever saw him in person but um, he was, like, he was, like, a minor, like, animatronic that you'd find, um, due to the fact that, um, I live in Illinois and not many people, like, um, uh, that I, uh, walked by had them. They just had, like, mostly inflatables or, like, animatronics that are, like, him, like, well, nothing like Haunt 31. That place is amazing. Maybe, but they wouldn't have Deathstalker. The only thing they have from Spirit is that Slimer butt thing. He's heavy and fat. Look, he's got a butt. A Slimer butt. <laughs> but honestly, um, this prop, we really need to come back. If, so, if they could just, I, well, we actually know he's online. But like, come on. Ricky Ratman was online only. Who, who we need, and Clowning Around, I bet it's online only. We don't know due to, but, like, on, we need, like, more in-store animatronics. Like, this is obviously not, not, no, I'm, I'm not, I'm not happy with this at all. I'm not happy that he's online only. He, it would be cool if it was, this is his first year, but, like, honestly, this, it doesn't really matter. Like, <laughs> it doesn't matter on, like, um, he's, like, in-store and we I mean, he would be in store because it was the mausoleum um, row and the Spirit Hollow Cemetery or Jack's Mausoleum. <laughs> but, like, he didn't really show up that much on YouTube channels either because, like, he showed up on Nate's YouTube channel and obviously Brick Thunders. But for my channel, I used him in the Once Upon a Studio thing. He showed up, like, multiple times in there. Um, they, he also shows up in other media, too, like, uncovering the resonance halfway to Halloween. You could see a little glimpse of his tombstone there. And, um, he also, quote-unquote, showed up at Flagship with the tombstone, uh, that they used to film it, which was pretty amazing. I wish we could brought those home, but, like, honest, but they kept it, and I'm not really, like, too happy with that. We, um, not because the tombstones were really cool to see and like the um uh we really didn't get to see him at all do i don't even think we got to sell the box of him at flagship did anybody see him um at flagship basically like in the box or whatnot i wouldn't be surprised if somebody did but honestly those guys snatched off the only thing I remember seeing is, like, I think it, either it was last year or 2022, where 
I saw a creepy towering clown. Yes, I saw him. But regardless, we need you back, Death Stalker. Those nice clothes, if I fall, I think I'll fly. Yeah.